You need to respect my personal space and leave me alone. Hello friends, it's me. And today we're going Karen hunting. Karen goes insane because the neighbors are doing fireworks. We got a show in the sky and on the sidewalk. <laughs> this is how my dog be acting when he hears fireworks. <laughs> she out here yelling at the mailbox. Leave the mailbox out of this. He ain't doing nothing wrong. <laughs> oh, my mail flap hurt. What are you filming me for? What I'm doing is not wrong. I live here. Ma'am, you don't live there. You live inside the house. Go back in. Skater versus Karen, my favorite. Just minding his own business trying to skate. She's trying to block him. Girl, you, you better watch them shins. Playing a dangerous game. You working real close to him. You got a crush on him or something? She's chasing after him. Girl, he's like half your age. Oh, she's trying to trip him. Does she really have nothing better to do than mess with kids on skateboards? This is a grown woman doing this. My day is not complete. I cannot have a good night's rest without messing with at least one skateboarder. Karen's food was taking way too long in the drive-thru, so she got up out of her car, walked up to the window. You're holding up the line there, Karen. Shut the poor meal you want to before I spit on you. Oh, she did it. I love when they give you permission to record them, so you won't mind when this ends up on the YouTube, right? Is that saliva out your mouth there, Karen? Holding up the line. I need my McChicken and my McNuggets. Get out the line there, Karen. Karen, he needs his McChicken. Get out the line. I love how it says warning. Approaching object. The car refuses to acknowledge her as a person. Like, back up. No, Karen, you're holding up the line there, Karen. Yeah, get out of here now, Karen. Thank you very much there for it on. I think this was a very effective way to deal with a Karen. Literally annoy the spirit of Karen out of them. There was a Karen on a very crowded New York City subway. And she wants somebody to give up their seat. Show me which one of you is going to be a gentleman. Show me. Show me which one of you is going to be a gentleman. Show me. Are there no gentlemen left in this? Are there no ladies left in this world? You can't expect guys to act like a gentleman when you can't even act like a lady. Here we got this banshee screeching in the middle of the subway like, Show me which one of you is going to be a gentleman. Show me. I'll be a gentleman if you just shut up. This Karen is angry that this guy was supposedly taking pictures of her. No, no, stay right here. Don't go nowhere. No, no, no I'm not going. I'm, I'm my calling the cops. Here. I don't care. What, you don't take pictures of nobody. That's against the law. But is it against the law? I don't know. I don't think so. Cause now he out here recording her. It's against the law. Keep it up. Keep it up. You're illegal and that's against the law. Uh, you just said taking pictures was illegal. Now the whole entire guy is illegal. I'm oh, yeah? here at Bank of America. A gentleman here, he's recording me and my kids. I don't know if he don't speak English, but this I is against the English. law and I'm telling him. And he just spoke English and she like, I don't know if you speak English. Is that supposed to make him a threat or something? Hi, you're parked in front of me. I'm parked in front of you? Yeah, I can see your car. Then get in the car. Walk to the car. Where where are you at? I'm at the door. Man, I'm I'm in the parking lot. I don't know where you are. Do you see my car? Oh god. So I'm gonna walk over to your car, but one of the reasons that I call for a ride is so that I do not have to walk. Karen, you know when you order Uber, you still have to walk to the car. What do you want him to do? Bust into the front door of the store? Like, yes, ma'am, your chariot awaits. There she is. She literally had to walk like 20 feet. You just like totally went past me and then over there and you're over here. Did I have a way of knowing that? I just called you and told you I'm standing at the door. Right, I've never been here before. I don't know where the door is. Does this okay. look like a door? Does this look like a door? I'm going to cancel the ride if you're going to be disrespectful. Oh. So it's it's up to you. Do I have to pay for it if you cancel it? I'll, I'll cancel it free of charge. Okay, let's do that. I'd yeah. like to see you cancel it. Uh, I'd like to see you cancel it. He just canceled it. Just great. I had a ride home. Okay. <sighs> The reason you put it in address is that so you can you can hop out. Address. You can hop out. Oh, now she has to walk another twenty feet back to the door and wait for another ride. Boo hoo, boo hoo. Oh, there's a phone here. Hey, hold on. She looks strangely familiar. Vegan teacher, that you? Oh, there's a phone here. Somebody hey, left their phone. Hey, hey, 
phone. Somebody that's left their phone. phone. That's my phone. Don't well, how do I know that? I just found a phone here. So how do I know that it's yours? Because we're filming a TikTok. Okay, I don't even know what that is. Uh, I don't know what that is. Uh, Tic Tac? You mean like the little mints? I, I don't know what that is. Oh my God. I wanted you to hit, I wanted you to hit okay. so it could be properly just, taken care of so the right person okay, can hit okay. it. You know, this could all be solved with, what's your passcode? Put in the passcode and, oh, so it is her phone. I can't with y'all. This is in a public parking lot where some dude needed help parking and asked his wife to get out of the car to help him park to be his backup camera. And Karen started freaking out because they almost hit her car. Watching you navigate your ass in here almost hitting me. And you're telling him to stop and you don't fit. I'm asking you to stop, go away, and you don't. You come closer. I'm in a legal proceeding for people like you that do that to me. It's don't. a human rights violation what? case. What? They're just trying to park next to you. They didn't even hit you. The wife's like, yes, you have room. Put the car in. Karen's like, no, you're too close. You're too close to my car. Uh, this is a human rights violation. I could have lost my life because you wanted to park too close to my car. Mm. It's a white female thing and white females don't understand what no, don't, stop, and go away mean. They violate me. Thank you. Record it. Oh, Get anyways. It the what? My name's Carla Ace. Capital K, capital oh. A. Capital K, capital A. She was a cheerleader back in the day. Because this is all you know how to do is violate people's human spaces. Actually, human we don't. Somebody roll up the window. Shut her up. I'm in my vessel, my space. Ma'am, you are the passenger of a car. You are violating my rights being that close to me. If only it was a crime to stand that close to somebody. I think I'm within my vessel. Can within my shut right up. No, I will never shut up. Ah. Okay, well, I'll re You need to respect my personal space and leave me alone. I'm minding my own business. That does not sound like minding your own business. Minding your own business is rolling up the window. Shutting up. Zip it. This Karen battery, 100%. She just don't stop. I'm saying back off. Okay, and white women have a hard time backing off. She acting like she lives there. She pays rent on that parking spot and all the ones around her. I've been in this community for nine months. They know who That's I am. No, I have definitely I'm a reputation in this community and you, you need definitely talk to the police. <laughs> Oh, she's got a reputation in this community, all right. Yeah, that crazy Karen that lives in her car barks at people when they get too close. And I'm in within my lines, my space, and I'm asking people to leave me alone. And she came closer and approached me. So whose rights are being violated? Whoa there, I can't believe this has escalated to this point. I feel like the person recording is just like, okay, okay, keep it coming. How much more content can you give me? I am triggered by white females that do not respect personal space. What? That is oddly specific. Triggered by females who don't respect my space. Yeah. I can prove yeah, no, ill intent. It's specific, it's measurable, it's a cumulative. Thanks. Ill intent. Okay, let's approval. get her stuff. She is insane. Like, actually insane. Oh, this is funny. No, honey, I want to go home. Uh, I don't even want to go to this park no more. This Karen insane. A Karen got a hold of the airport mic because her flight was delayed. It's supposed to be on a flight to Memphis. Oh my God. Our connection was delayed. We're at L24, can you please open the gate? So the gate was closed when they got there and they're like trying to blame everybody like, you missed your flight. What do you want them to do? They already closed the gate. The plane took off. Hello, tell the plane to come back. I must be on my flight. This happens way too often. L24, can you please open the gate? He's really banging on the window like, hey, can the people on the airplane hear me? How could the plane leave? Without us. So they were at a carnival, and this Karen was like, y'all need to leave. My 10 year old is here, and you guys are just like hookers. I don't see nothing wrong with what she's wearing, but. You better quit, because I'm two seconds from socking you. So stop. She about two seconds from greasing up my pan with that face. I've got my 10 year old with me, so yeah. quit. Get out of here. I'm sorry, it's so embarrassing. Going up to girls and being like, you need to leave because you're dressed like that. If you don't like some, you need to leave. This Karen is calling the cops on this dude because he's in her neighborhood. He works as pest control. Oh, perfect. We got a large pest right here. What are you trying to sell? I'm selling pest control. Do you want to buy from pest control? No. Okay. Have a good night so then. So do you have, no, I want to, no, I'm a trustee here in the village and I want to know what you're doing here. I'll call you right back. She was on the phone with Barbara. Like, you know what? Barbara, I'm going to call you back. I need to call the police on this one. This dude out here selling pest control to people, handing out flyers, advertising his business. I've got some solicitors here that are going around trying to sell pest control, and I'm a little worried about it. I'm a little worried about 
about it that this dude is going around selling pest control, like advertising his business. I am scared for my life in my own community. You see, I can be a pest and I'm just worried that he might exterminate me. At least she's self-aware. This lady kicked my husband out of his seat so she could sit there. Now he's standing at the window wondering what he did wrong. He's holding a baby. There are plenty of other seats. It's all empty. I like this one specific seat. I farted here once and it was a pleasant memory for me and I will be sitting here from now on. This dude has been living in the same house for 25 years and has been dealing with this Karen for over 10 years. I can do whatever I want. I'm allowed to cut wood. No, you're not. You sure? Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. I, 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 I already talked to the village. You can call anybody you want, but I'm allowed to cut wood. I have a big giant truckload coming in a half hour. I'm gonna fill up the whole yard. Wood. I hope you like cutting wood because I, I got a lot more where that came from. I mean, I get it if it's making a lot of sound That's annoying. I don't know who's in the wrong here neighbors who are very loud are just annoying in general I don't know how I feel about having a neighbor that like is constantly karate chopping wood But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video comment below Let me know which one of these is the most annoying Karen and if you guys enjoyed this video Make sure to hit that like button in the and make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click, and subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.